Hello, this is Gladys at Angel Works 3110. I'm going to be using this deck on my channel for the messages that I do. Hope you guys enjoy. This deck was created by Colette Baron Creed. For those out there that like to get new decks all the time and learn new decks, I would like to say that I bought two different decks. I bought the bigger version kit set deck and the smaller version that has that small guidebook deck and they're both different so if you buy both of them the numbers are going to be different and there's going to be one different card in each separate deck to find out more about that just watch the video at the end of this video it will either be on the screen or at the top right hand side in both guidebooks the goddesses are in alphabetical order and the words that are attached of course they are not just so that you know but I am pulling these cards as I do the messages and make videos at the end for those cards that I pull. Thank you guys for watching. Enjoy. The empowerment message is the appearance of the Celtic Earth God Danu who gives birth to magic, pretends the fulfillment of your desires and the fruition of your dreams. Whatever it is that you're inquiring about, Danu gives you her assurance that you're in the process of becoming. Now is the time to trust whatever you have planted, planned, or worked toward is being lovingly birthed. All you need to do is stay with the flow of events and be ready for the, your next opportunity in this situation. Everything has its perfect season. Just as fallow ground carries the promise of new life that appears again in the spring, as if magically bind in the invisible to visible, Danu offers her promise of the grounded assurance. The alignment message is that there are days when you wonder if you're on the right track, if your dreams are valid, if you have what it takes to show up and shine. You may hit a dry spill where it appears that nothing is happening and it makes you doubt yourself this time. But when this earth goddess appears, she is reminding you of the promise of new life. Just as fields are often left purposely fallow, perhaps that seemingly dry spell of yours is really a preparation time for you to focus and try to prepare yourself for a new beginning. Under the ground of your visible life lies a stream of abundance that is feeding the roots of the seedling of your intentions planted in your field of dreams. Go about your day-to-day -day life with faith. Daniel assures you that the form of your desires will show up in divine timing and in even more magical way than you could ever even imagine. Stay positive, guys. Rebirth something, plant something, do something that you can watch grow. And it could be from a seed that you get from the grocery store, from something that you eat. Save that seed, plant it, and watch it grow. Look up things to figure out new ways of doing some kind of new thing and give it time. For it to grow and, and you got to nurture it so that you can see the fruition of whatever this is that you're trying to implement in your new way of seeing things stay in spirit keep praying and don't doubt just give to the universe and let things happen in divine timing the end i hope you guys enjoyed this video learn the decks as i do messages I will try to make videos of the decks that I use like this and I will break the video down into in-depth messages of what's in the book but when I say the cards on the message it won't be breakdowns but to get the breakdowns on it you'll have to watch the end of the video to get the special video links that I will post at the end of the video thank you guys for watching this video please don't forget to like subscribe and share my videos and remember to use those numbers that you see on any cards relate them to angel messages and always treat others the way you want to be treated god bless <laughs>